My name is Elin Martinsson and I'm a PhD student in Core Project 6. So my PhD project uh, largely evolves around evaluating the consequences of new technology. So what happens on farms when a new technology is being implemented on farm level. So for example, this can have implications for uh, farm structures and it can also have unexpected outcomes on, uh, for example, environmental effects. So my research enables to uh, uh, know or to predict what consequences the technology which is currently being developed in Finero will have when it reaches the farm level. So by using the technology which is already implemented, we can see uh, patterns and mechanisms which will also probably be triggered by this new technology. So instead of just waiting and see what will happen with farms when they have this new robotic uh, technology, we can uh, uh, already now predict what consequences this might have. And this knowledge can be useful for the technology developers, uh, but also to um, design policies. So we can know which farms do we want to adopt the new technology and what potential adverse effects do we want to avoid. The courses I benefited the most from was scientific writing and science communication, because we spend a lot of our days writing um, our science. So if I come up with all this progress and all these good ideas and no one wants to read my papers, there's no, not really a point in it. So it's very important to have the skills to also put the progress into words and also um, um, the course in communication is also was very helpful to uh, be less afraid to have presentations and also being able to use the um, tools and strategies to make people want to listen to my talks. So from the work balance course, I think my main takeaway was that it's not about balancing uh, work with life, but it's about making work an integrated part of your life that should work also in the long run. And I think that's important for also for PhD students not to see just the PhD as something you should get over with and then continue with your life, but that you should, that you need to be able to have the PhD position as a good part in your life. And also that if there are things uh, that you don't want or not feel happy with, you have the power to change them was also something we talked a lot about. Yeah, so I think it's great to be part of Finerov, to uh, be part of this large uh, scientific community. So I get to meet many people from other disciplines and I also get to feel like my research fits into a larger, larger picture. And also, of course, having spoken about the graduate training program, it's also a privilege to be able to take part of that and all the courses offered there. And also we get good opportunities to travel and get supported in going to conferences and such, which I think is a great um, privilege to have that. Mm -hmm.